I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and through the republic for which is dance one nation under God indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Erie High. I'm Chloe Burton. Welcome to Royal TV. Today is Thursday, September 29th. Dismissal for students located on the north side of the building is at 347. Dismissal for students on the south side of the building is at 350. The swim team will have a preseason conditioning every Tuesday and Thursday for the month of October, starting Tuesday, October 5th. Practices will run from 4.30 to 5.30 and will begin in Mr. Wilmoth's room, room 141. Preseason practices will consist of out-of-water exercises, so please bring gym clothes to work out. Interested swimmers should see Mr. Roberts in room 302 or Mr. Wilmoth in room 141 for more information. Good luck to our Erie High athletes. Ashley Kerstetter has more from our sports desk. Good morning, Erie High. Good luck to the members of the girls' golf team. They tee off today in the District 10 Championships. The girls' tennis team has a match today at 4 p.m. against Fairview. The girls' JV and varsity soccer team travels to Bradford today. Varsity plays at 5, JV at 6.30. The girls' volleyball team plays Villa today. JV plays at 6, and varsity takes the court at 7.15. Good luck, Royals. The green lunch trays are back in use here at Erie High School. Mr. Orlando has the details. Good morning teachers, good morning students. Uh, just so everyone is aware, there is a national styrofoam tray shortage. Yes, you heard me correct. There is a national styrofoam tray shortage. So what's that mean for us? Well, if you notice in the cafeteria, they've been getting really creative with how they're giving you your lunches lately, but now we're gonna go back to what you did in middle school. If you guys remember in middle school, those green trays that you used to use, um, that you'd have to stack up real nicely at the end of the lunch when you threw your lunch away. Um, that, we're going back to that. So again, there is a national, national styrofoam tray shortage. I never thought I'd say that on announcements, but yes, it is true. So you're going to go back to your green trays, right? So we don't throw those out when we're done. So after we're done with our lunch, we go to throw whatever items away we need to throw away. We throw those in the garbage. There'll be the silver little carts there. You'll take your green tray, you'll stack it on that silver cart. And we want to make sure that we stack them nicely so they're not falling all over the place. So I always, we used to say, back at Wilson when I was there, I used to say stack them circle to circle so you match those up, then they'll stack up real nice. So our workers and our students or whoever's taking those trays back to be washed can take those back without them falling everywhere. So again, I appreciate all of your help with doing this, students. I know you've done it before, but again, a national styrofoam tray shortage has brought us to the point where we're using those green trays here at the high school. If you take the bus, listen up. Bus routes 300 and 503 will be parked on West 34th Street. Bus route numbers 301, 302, and 303 will be located in Erie High Attendance Loop located off Cherry Street. Buses will begin loading at 3.55 p.m. and the buses will leave at 4 p.m. Your parents should not park along the West 34th Street or in the Attendance Loop at dismissal. If you need a new ID card, go to the main lobby during your lunch. The first reprint of the ID card is free. After that, it's $5. School ID cards printed with the E logo on them will serve as both your school ID and bus pass. Mr. Brzezinski is in charge of transportation and bus passes. Please see him for more bus information. If you have any thoughts or concerns about our ear high, join our spirit council. This group discusses concerns and solutions, then presents them to our Erie High School Board. The first meeting will be October 5th at the end of third period during fourth lunch in the Erie Sports Lab in the back of the library. All students are welcome. The first meeting will be October 5th at the end of third period during fourth lunch in the Erie Sports Lab at the back of the library. All students are welcome. Seniors, there are 107 historically black, black colleges and universities in the U.S. There is a donor who would like to sponsor five students to apply to any of these schools. If you are interested, please see Ms. Shaw in the South office. Those are your morning announcements from all of us here at Royal TV. Have a Royal Day. We leave you today with a special announcement from our Spanish department in recognition of Hispanic Heritage Month. Feliz Maestra Happy Hispanic Heritage Month from here to God.
National Hispanic Heritage Month starts on September 15th to October 15th. Your morning announcements are brought to you by the Erie High School Digital Media Department. All of us here would like to remind you to stop the spread of germs that can make you and others sick. Wash your hands often, wear a cloth face cover, cover your coughs and sneezes, keep six feet of space between you and your friends.